Well, hello again, my friends. Today, we are going into Longhorn Steakhouse to have ourselves an amazing lunch. So this Longhorns is actually in Blairsville. It is newly built, so we're going to see just how delicious their food is compared to other Longhorns. So what is on the menu today? First, you have to start out with that delicious, freshly baked bread and butter. What is better than slicing into that fresh, warm bread, watching the steam emerge from that slice, only to determine that you need some butter. So then you want to get a decent slab of butter and just smear it all over that delicious bread, watching it melt. That is my favorite bite to begin a delicious lunch. So then here comes the menu. Whether you want an appetizer, a lunch combo plate, a delicious salad for your entree, or maybe some type of steak. Longhorns has it all. I usually start out with an appetizer, um, whether it be a Texas Tunyon or a simple salad. But it's up to you, whatever you're looking for. And don't forget those delicious desserts. My suggestion is the chocolate stampede. So here is the salad that I got with my meal. It is just your basic salad with the lettuce, some cheese, croutons, and your choice of a salad dressing. This salad also had some little chunks of tomato, which were actually pretty good. Now for the appetizer, I chose to get the Texas Tunyon. The Texas Tunyon comes with a delicious house-made sauce. So it has kind of a horseradish kick to it. It almost tastes like Thousand Island dressing with a hint of horseradish. So definitely if you get it, you have to give it a try because it's actually pretty good. But also, you can try ketchup or my personal favorite, that buttermilk ranch dressing. So, which sauce would you choose if you went? Ketchup, the Texas Tunyon sauce, or ranch? Finally, it is on to the entree. This is the Renegade Sirloin. It is always good to dip that bite in some ranch dressing for a unique flavor twist. Now on to my favorite is the Steakhouse Mac and Cheese, which is only here for a limited time. Paired with that delicious Flo's Filet. Let me tell you, this is a perfect combination if you are a steak and mac and cheese lover. So this is my first time having a filet mignon at Longhorn Steakhouse and I was actually pretty surprised. The meat was really tender, perfectly cooked, medium well. And it chewed just like butter. It was so perfect. Now to that mac and cheese. Just look at this cheesy, ooey, gooeyness, which is just simply perfect. This mac and cheese is topped with a breadcrumb cheese mix, which adds for a little bit of a crunch. And as you're eating into it, you get to the bottom and you find these delicious bacon bits, which add the perfect flavor profile to that cheese 
and breadcrumb mixture. Definitely one to try. Now let's not forget about dessert, y'all. Chocolate Stampede. You get two hearty scoops of vanilla bean ice cream. Two significantly portioned slices of that seven layer chocolate stampede. Topped with Cool Whip and a chocolate drizzle. This is always my go-to dessert anytime I go to Longhorns because there is nothing that compares to it. No matter where you go or the cake that you buy in the store, you will never be able to replicate this. It has a chocolate ganache, a chocolate mousse, chocolate cake, and it has this interesting fudgy layer in there. It's just simply divine when you compare it to any other cake. And the ice cream just adds the perfect touch to top it off. So just to go back through of that delicious meal, you have your bread to start the meal with, free of course, an appetizer, which I chose the Texas Tunyon, which was perfectly cooked, the house salad, which is decently portioned. If you can handle it with a meal, by all means, I suggest getting it. Then you have the Flo's Filet with that delicious steakhouse mac and cheese. Definitely a must try. The Flo's Filet was perfect, soft, and even later when I saved some of it for home, it was still perfectly tender. Or you can choose the Renegade Sirloin, which is more reasonably priced, but in my opinion, it's not as tender. Then you have that amazing chocolate stampede that just says you need to try a bite. Or if you're not a chocolate lover, go ahead and get a Caramel Apple Gold Rush to take home. It's delicious as well. And there you have it. If you are near Longhorns, be sure to stop by and try one of those favorites today. Yeah,